this was all streamed live on my Twitch, twitch.tv slash Jenny Jinxie. I stream every single Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday, so please join us. But without further ado, please enjoy the video. Come on, don't be so nervous. So we're gonna watch character teaser, Shinyun, Disconcernment, and Integrity. Into there's not integrity, there's no R there. Intenguity? Inten I think that's it. Teehee. Huh? A story about Master? Let me think. Aww. Hmm. Master Wait. is a great inventor. Where did that come from? Am I blind? As a child, I shut my mouth. All kinds of toys for me. <sighs> drink my coffee milk. Advanced for me. <laughs> but they always That's so showed me cute. How much she cared. <laughs> oh. Do you want to hear a story about Master? Master might say she likes peace and quiet, but she doesn't mind getting visitors on Mount Outsong. <laughs> In truth. She does get lonely if no one ever goes to see her. Look at <laughs> Cloud retainer, you say? <laughs> yes, this is so I funny. know a tale or two. There was a time when she preferred to appear in human form, and was revered as a bold and decisive figure. me when I sneeze. Oh my god, she's got like purple lipstick. I mean not purple, I'm fucking colorblind. The the green. Speaks about one behind one's back. Not her talking in the fucking APA format. I'm sure you will have the chance to very soon. The teal lipstick, yes. Sorry. <laughs> and a dev dyke casually walking the streets of Bleeway. Little gun used to cute she is. Okay. I love this. This was very, very cute. Like genuinely. I think it's just so funny. Oh no, she sees prepare yourselves. I'm a little scared about that too, but it's fine. She's such a mom, and we knew her as a mom. So seeing her being told by people around her, like Ganyu and Shinha, is hilarious to me. Little Ganyu playing with these toys, and she's like, I'm so proud of myself. It really does give like kind of like Asian mom vibes things of what I don't know. I can just totally picture a mom being like, My little genius is gonna have like this super advanced block system thing and it's for like a 10 year old and they're giving it to a fucking three year old but it's just such a, a proud moment i love it and i like how they're showing her in bird form here i think that really adds to the hilarity of this i feel like cloud retainer taking care of shinha and ganyu would be such a cute little children's book like a bird taking care of humans i don't know like, look how proud she is there. That's so fucking smug. It's so funny. Do you think, like, Ganyu, besides, like, for her horns and stuff, do you think she ever got bullied because her mom was a bird? I don't get me wrong. I know that the deadline is, like, kick the kid's ass, but... Oh, no, wait. And then Shinha's got her nail polish. I, I kind of love that. It makes me feel like they had a girl's night, and she did Shinha's nails, and she's the same color for her lipstick. And this part is so funny. <laughs> I always feel like somebody's watching me. Like, okay, Shinha's watching Traveler, and Cloud Retainer, I'm pointing as if you guys can see my thing, and Cloud Retainer is watching Shinha watching Traveler. She's so lonely. She's literally the saying the birds have left the nest because Shinha and Ganyu are all grown up now. I think that's so funny. And then Zhang Li is like, oh, yeah, that bitch, I know her human form. Stalking the stalker for real. I also 
also everyone bowing to her. That's so iconic. I'm the same way. She's very pretty. I really like her silhouette. I think they did a really good job capturing both the birdness of her, but also then making it into a human. I wonder if she ever did, did turn into a human to like create those things, because you gotta have opposable thumbs, you know? I don't know why this needs was necessary. I, I I don't think it was, but anyways. I I like that she has the little fucking anime glasses thing. And also this whole like who speaks about one behind one's back. We've talked about this before, but she talks like MLA APA format, which if you don't know what that is, it's when you're writing like an academic essay and you're not really supposed to use first person words. So if you were to say like, I think that pizza is the best food on the planet, you would have to be like, one might think pizza is the best food on the planet. You can't say I. The sneeze, is, the sneeze was due to humor. See, the thing is with the sneeze is I view it as her like being human. You know, she is weakness. She can get sick. It, sneezes are usually like innocent things. The reason I'm scared for sneezes is um for reasons that people tend to make compilations of girls sneezing. That's why I'm scared for the sneeze. Oh, that makes so much more sense. I didn't even think about that. You know, in Japan, when someone sneezes, it's common to think that someone is talking about you, which is, yes, I totally forgot about that. You know, in Japan, when someone sneezes, it's common to think about someone's talking about you, which is fine for the most part. I forgot about that. I, um, my brain went straight to the gutter, which it shouldn't have, but it is, <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> We're okay though, but I fucking love that she still talks in third person. I think it's really funny. And it's not even like the traditional third person crazy character like Paimon. It's like, well, Paimon's name is Paimon. No, it's literally APA MLA format. And I think that's really fucking funny, especially as like a literature major. Okay, I want to watch her other video she has. Bye -bye. The giveaway is Zhang Li who was going to speak about her and then she complained about it. <laughs> that makes sense. See, I did not put that together because I was I wasn't thinking, but when am I ever? That's a lie, I think, but it's on very rare and certain occasions. Okay, so we're gonna watch character demo Shenyun unfreddered as the wind. Hmm, for a modern heroine, we need a modern weapon. Quite. The likes of swords, staffs, spears, and bows are ubiquitous in opera. We need something more original. For example... Gusto. Gusto? <laughs> this is my favorite fucking thing ever. I just had an idea. I just had an idea. <laughs> I'm so funny. Someone by someone, I mean me, I should edit how to make a man out of you, but it's Cloud Retainer singing and Ganyu and Shinha basically training. I think that would be really funny because I could picture a workout montage of the three of them. Anyways, back to our regularly scheduled program. So, invention is the better part of valor. Stop! <sighs> I can't use any of this in the script. She's utterly ridiculous. An inventress? What a load of... I love that. Well, have I convinced you yet? Uh, uh, absolutely! Please, <laughs> Miss Inventress, pull me down from here, please! 
I have so many thoughts on that. Back to the beginning. I love the fact that we start off here with like Shinha and Ganyu. Um, it's they really are playing on the fact like yeah, she's their mom. And I think that's really funny, but also really nice because I don't know. I just I like the dynamic of the three of them a lot. And I always love when videos do that thing where it goes to narrow to big or big to narrow. I think it's a such a simple cinematic thing that like people can do. I wish because they're showing it, we had more of um Cloud Retainer being in bird form and then transforming into her person form. Unless they do have that, I don't think we do, but they show it here, which is why like not this, but like actually bird form. Because they do show it here, like earlier. But overall, I think character wise and design wise, she is one of their best recently. Kit wise, I don't think she's anything like show stopping. I think she's really cool. I think she has a certain niche that I didn't even know we needed to be fulfilled. But as a result, a character being too niche makes it harder for like free to play people to want them because you don't really need that. But otherwise, I think she covers a lot of other basics that they haven't had. I don't know. She's got a lot of spunk and flavor that maybe I'm just missing because we've had so many Fontaine characters and now I, I'm a little nostalgic for Lewe, but overall I I think she's so pretty. I just like looking at her design and I really like her tying into both Shinha and Ganyu because both of them are characters I felt like. Ganyu we've known for a really long time because she's one of like the first five stars we've gotten, especially in terms of like Lantern Right. And then Shinha was just heavily involved in like the Jade Chamber and everything. So I think her being intertwined with both of them just really makes it and I just think it's such a cute little family dynamic and this and I don't know having the nods to the two of them being here for her I love it like I want to know about Cloud Retainer taking care of them when they were younger and how they are like two of like the best fighters in Liwe is she's just such a mom and I really love her for it and I don't know and this also kind of makes me want her weapon because she looks really fucking cool with it but it's not worth it I can't I cannot do it what do you guys think of these videos because I sometimes I wish with these videos they open like Genshin up with them kind of like Fortnite does so at the beginning of the season Fortnite forces you to watch a video that kind of introduces why the map has changed and everything but you can skip it obviously but I think having it there because before content creating and getting on the scene of Genshin like online I used to just play it for myself my friends like we'd all play it together but I never scanned through forums online before streaming and everything and so I didn't know half of these existed until I started streaming streaming and I started uh, saw other people watching them so I don't know what you guys think I wish they kind of forced you to watch them kind of like Fortnite and so it's like such a weird thing to compare Genshin to Fortnite but yeah that's what I think I genuinely think besides her kit being so niche she checks so many boxes and you know what niche could also be like its own good thing in a way where a character is very selective and I don't know I do think she is Apology. I can't add that to the YouTube video. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please join us live. I stream every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday, and I hope to see you all then. But for now, goodbye!